Black Friday bargain hunting began earlier than ever this year. Stores that opened on Thanksgiving night had plenty of shoppers waiting. A new Gallup poll finds only 18 percent of American adults plan to shop today. The people who do plan to shop say that sale prices are the biggest reason ahead of getting the shopping done. And family tradition, that plays a factor, too. Seth Doan is at a Target store in Jersey City, New Jersey, one of the stores where shoppers got a head start last night. So, Seth, what are the crowds like today? Well, Gail, in many ways, they're not as crazy as you generally imagine for Black Friday. A lot of that craziness happened last night when stores opened 8, 9 o'clock. You saw long lines in front of stores. The store we're at here at Target had a very long line, hundreds of people in line at 8 o'clock. So just imagine now these stores have been open for 11 or so hours. But one of the things we're hearing anecdotally from Target is that people appear to be spending more time in these stores, and they're not just coming in and buying the TVs, they're spending time in the houseware, in the home section, because it's a more leisurely evening experience is that Black Friday creep has crept into Thanksgiving Day. So there's been a lot of talk about online shopping, changing the turnout. Have you seen any indication of that in your location? Well, yeah, absolutely. You see a lot more of these, Gail. Barcodes, uh, these are their top selling toys. You can go to the toy aisle and scan the barcode and ship it to your loved one anywhere in the country for free. That's happening as these stores really try to compete with the convenience that can be found online. Also, everyone's using these apps. Too, I walked in today, I put on an app called Shopkick, and it gave me points for just coming into the store. Obviously, retailers want you to come into the store. Ideally, you'll maybe buy a little more than you planned on if you were just shopping online. Seth Doan, thank you very much.